Well, hundreds of people came together today in hopes of bringing Madeline Kingsbury home. The Winona mother vanished one week ago after dropping her children at daycare. The search today targeted remote areas in Fillmore and Winona counties. Jennifer Hoff was in Winona today with those volunteers. A search this morning started early. Some 500 volunteers filed onto buses from the Goodview Fire Department, prepared to look for Maddie Kingsbury, missing now for one week. We remain very hopeful that we will bring Maddie back home to her family. Local authorities say they're searching Winona, Fillmore, and Houston counties for the 26-year-old, last seen dropping her children off at daycare with her partner, who later left in Kingsbury's van. The chief not answering questions about him and whether he was cooperating, only saying Kingsbury's disappearance is suspicious, but there's no suspect. As people like Scott Johnsgard aren't giving up. I kind of felt it was just something, being on a fire department and ambulance, it was something I needed to do. The dad with three daughters will have combed two miles today, flat terrain here, but the other areas are full of hills, valleys, even swamps, part of a systematic search that's the largest ever in this area. You got to look for like signs of struggle, signs of maybe a car went off the road in one spot that looks fresh stuff like that. The sheriff reminding residents to keep an eye out for anything out of place. Check your cameras, surveillance cameras, doorbell cameras, your trail cameras. You know your properties better than we do. For perhaps a final piece that could finally help bring Maddie Kingsbury home. Kingsbury's family telling me they are just hopeful that they find her soon and they are offering a $50,000 reward. In Winona County, Jennifer Hoff, CARE 11 News. Volunteers are needed for another search tomorrow. We have details at care11.com, along with a link to a GoFundMe for Maddie's family to help cover the costs of these searches.